Hello my friends and viewers, now I am going to review a uh, vehicle which I have uh, got, uh, which I had uh, bought with a uh, 50% discount uh, because I was uh, quite lucky this time. It's, uh, it is React Free VK107 or VK107 which is a uh, yak free with a uh, more powerful engine and uh, probably a precursor to yak 11 which was produced post-war and uh, gifted to several countries uh, alongside with the yak 9 uh, such as uh, north vietnam and uh, northern korea because the soviet, the soviet union was a friend to these countries this uh, aircraft has a more powerful engine uh, with, uh, uh, than a Yak-3 uh, equipped with a tur turbocharger which allows it uh, to reach greater speeds on uh, high altitudes and uh, altitudes and uh, it also has a 20 millimeter B20M uh, cannon instead of Schwag cannon and uh, a pretty similar B20S cannon uh, in place of uh, uh, UBS uh, high caliber machine gun. Uh, the letter M uh, in the cannon's name means uh, Maturne or motor cannon and uh, S means uh, synchronized or synchronized cannon, which uh, means uh, that uh, the cannon uh, placed uh, uh, about the engine uh, under the under the engine cover is uh, cannon synchronized with the propeller movement, with the cannon equipped with a synchronizer and uh, the cannon uh, with M letter is a motor cannon which shots uh, through the uh, through the propeller shaft uh, like uh, the cannons found on Messerschmitt's uh, BF-109 This uh, aircraft uh, is uh, unfortunately my first battles uh, on this aircraft were spoiled uh, by the fact that my keyboard had died and I tried playing War Thunder with a remote, uh, small remote keyboard uh, for smart TV with uh, which my smart TV turned out to be incompatible because it uh, has a motherfucking uh, Samsung Tizen operating system on which you cannot uh, neither delete uh, neither install new apps so and uh, yesterday I had bought a new keyboard In my opinion, it's one of the best planes uh, to do marathon in because uh, it has uh, decent speed, decent turn, ra turn rate and uh, decent climb too. It's overall a decent plane uh, and it is, it is also equipped with two uh, cannons with high fire rate which is uh, both uh, the uh, better side and both the downside of these cannons because uh, your ammo pool is uh, very small you have uh, 240 rounds 120 per each gun and uh, you are going to run out uh, quickly of these rounds So now I'm returning to base because uh, my uh, 
engine got uh, damaged uh, and I got a uh, fuel leak. Oh, no, sorry, oil leak. Like on most uh, planes uh, with uh, uh, whose engines have a liquid cooling system uh, or water cooling system. Uh, unfortunately, Yak Free the cast 107 engine is pretty vulnerable to damage, and if your radiator or uh, oil uh, 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 or oil radiator, water radiator, or oil radiator get uh, punched uh, through, uh, you are eventually going to run out of oil. Uh, or and or water which will lead to your engine quickly overheating and uh, going out of service which will lead uh, you to crash landing or death uh zeus i strongly don't rec i strongly recommend against going uh, head on uh, uh, in this plane, uh, unless uh, the situation uh, doesn't allow for any other maneuver. The belt I recommend uh, for loading into your guns on Yak-3 VK 107 is uh, the universal one or versatile, I don't know uh, exactly how it's called in English, uh, because uh, the Soviet guns uh, tend to have a really useful armor piece in incendiary rounds and uh, uh, high explosive incendiary rounds and the bell and the versatile belt for uh, Yak 3 VK 107 has uh, uh, two high explosive incendiary and one uh, armor piece in incendiary round per each uh, four shells of the belt which make it pretty effective at uh, setting enemy planes alight. I also advise uh, you to dive very carefully in Yak-3 VK 107 uh, because uh, the plane's flutter is uh, somewhere near uh, 740 km per hour which is a pretty low mark for a plane of such epoch and era it is much lower. It is much slower than uh, Messerschmitts and Pocky Wolves can die. So I recommend against boom zooming in uh, Yak-3 VK 107. Instead, try to turn fight your enemies uh, and drag them into dogfight. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, and please support Ukraine in whatever way you can. Slava Ukraini, and see you later.